How's it going, everyone? How you doing? Welcome back to the channel. It's Ye Golden here. And today, ladies and gentlemen, we're taking on Poke Pidge and the Welsh Dreadigans. Uh, if I recall correctly, last season didn't go so well against them. Uh, we only got one matchup, the regular season matchup against them, but it did not go so well. Uh, our overall record, I believe, is 2-1, and one, I think, against Pidge. I feel like I've only faced him twice. Uh, three times, sorry. Uh, but anyways. He is currently 3-0. He's currently leading the league ahead of everyone, ahead of the whole pack. This is our opportunity, though, to overtake him. Um, if we could do this, I think we get first. So I, that's what we're shooting for. I I was not very confident against his, against his team. I had a conversation with Lionheart Plays. He helped me really figure out. He helped me just all these thoughts because I have a bunch of thoughts that just like linger out here. He helped me just focus them, bring them all in. Um, because I, I I think a certain way, and he thinks a different way, but his way usually controls my way, if that makes sense. Um, I, I was able to rein everything in and be like, okay, all right, it makes a lot of sense. That's kind of what I was thinking, but I couldn't quite, like, materialize it, I guess is the word. Um, so, yeah, I was able to bring everything in, and I have a decent plan against him. I think it'll work. Um... I'm scared if we have to face him again, but <laughs> his team his team is, is pretty scary. His legends are pretty scary, so uh, I feel like I've said that about every team we face this season. So <laughs> his team is pretty scary, but I'm, I'm confident that we can maneuver our way to a victory. Um, and yeah, I really needed that conversation with Lionheart Plays because with Umberto, because uh, I was just all over the place with this. <laughs> but he helped me refocus and get everything in line. Um, so yeah. We're we got a team ready. <laughs> we'll see if we can actually pull this off. Uh, but we're gonna get all connected with Lionheart Play. Oh, Lionheart Play. He's just on my mind. He's always on my mind. Uh, we're just gonna <laughs> we're gonna get connected with Pidge and uh, get this battle started. All right, we are linked up with Sir Pidge. Single battle normal rules is what we use. For those of you might not know, there's there's a little bit of a difference. Hold on, real quick. This is our team. This is the team we're gonna be bringing. Be bringing. I cannot speak. Let me write it down real quick, because I forgot to do that, as I always do. So, Galeo, Reshiram, Grim, Snarl, Venusaur, Blaziken, and Palafin. Palafinian. Um, there is a slight difference between level 50 and level 100. It's it's about percentage, like, like 8% difference, but hey. That percent can make a big difference if you're battling level 100. So, we're gonna be leading Vermithor. I stole names from Lionheart. <laughs> I stole most of his team from last season, if you haven't noticed. So I went ahead and stole all his names. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we're gonna be, oh wow, he didn't, see, I had this in my head. I had this in my head. I knew it! I knew he wasn't gonna bring the Confei, and I had it in my head that he might not bring the Zamazenta either. I knew it. I know Pidge. I know him. I freaking knew it, dude. I freaking knew it. And he brought the Snorlax, too. He brought the... Sly King. Yeah, okay. Sly King is the only one I'm a little surprised by. I knew he wouldn't bring the freaking Zamazenta. Or the Confei. I knew it. I know that thing, that little freaking lay has been on a tear, but I knew he wouldn't bring it against me. I knew he wouldn't. I knew it. But I was so, like, hesitant about it. I was so hesitant about it, and he freaking brought it. Oh, that's annoying. That is so annoying. All right. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's see what he leads, most importantly. I freaking knew he wouldn't bring that thing. I'm like the kid. You know that, that kid dancing in the nightclub? That's me. He led Mimikyu. Okay. Wait. We gotta wait for the drop, Paige. We gotta wait for the drop. I'm sorry. We gotta wait for the drop. We gotta wait for the job. Why are we still communicating? That's not good. Okay, turbo blaze. Anyways. <laughs> Alright. Um I'm not gonna shadow ball because turbo blaze does turbo blaze go through the skies? That's a good question. I feel like it should. It it gets through oh, we're gonna have to look this up. I should have had it already ready. I feel like it should. On paper, it should. It does go through this, guys. Okay. We're gonna fusion fly. He's gonna swords dance. We go straight through that. Do we kill is the question. If we don't kill, he's gonna he's gonna shadow uh um, not shadow snake. Yeah, shadow snake, sorry. We don't kill. Okay. We go right through that disguise. 
He's gonna hit us before he dies. He's gonna let it go. I know, bitch. If he doesn't let it go, I'll be really surprised. I mean, it still has this disguise, so I guess. Oh, I was gonna say. Yeesh, that did a lot. That did a lot. That did a lot, but Mimikyu's dead. Um. Reshi. I didn't wanna switch out just in case. Maybe I should have hard switched to. No, no, that wouldn't have worked. That wouldn't have worked. No. I'm okay with that decision. Maybe I shouldn't be. <laughs> My hair is all jacked up. Look. <laughs> We're on another wavelength today, ladies and gentlemen. I'm feeling it. Snorlax is serene. Okay. 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 Going over my notes, I'm sorry. Um Snorlax is a bulky B. I was gonna say it, but I'm not gonna say it. Snorlax is bulky. So this is not gonna do much. It's gonna earthquake us and we're gonna die, which is fine. Kind of. That's fine. Okay. <laughs> Here's a little it's attack noise. <laughs> Snorlax kills Reshi. Um, tempting. Not yet. Tempting, but not yet. We kill. Go for it. He's gonna switch. We get the speed boost, and we're able to get a hit on anything. Blaziken is here to hit. It is not here to do much else. <laughs> it is here to hit. <laughs> It's here to hit like a truck. He's gonna switch to Mewtwo. If he's switching to anyone, it's gonna be Mewtwo or Mudsdale. Or Mudsdale. Which is fine. Like I said. Me uh, Blaziken's not here to hit. I mean, Blaziken's only here to hit. That's what I meant. He went to Mudsdale, okay. Stamina. <laughs> Stamina, stamina, stamina. This is fine. Uh, 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 uh. Tempting, 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 tempting. He's gonna EQ. We could we could just hard switch. Do I wanna give up Venusaur this early? Do I wanna give up Venusaur this early? Is the question really. Because Blazer King can serve us. Especially with the slacking of Snorlax. I'm down. I'm down. He can't kill us. Oh, famous last words. I shouldn't have said that. I shouldn't have said that. Okay. Yeah, he can't kill us. We're gonna Giga Drain. Not overthink it. <clears throat> He's gonna switch. Pidge is a switch guy. He's a switch master. Nintendo switch master. <laughs> the guy switches like nobody's business. He's not afraid to switch. He's gonna go to Cinderace. Okay. So that means he's gonna stay fire. <clears throat> he's gonna stay fire. Could hard swap to Finn. we will take a hit. Hard swap to Finn. Swap out back to Venusaur. And let Venusaur die so that Finn gets up. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. We have 30 seconds. What else do we got? I should have just given up Venusaur. Mm, I don't like this either. Ah, <laughs> I'm trying to get in Pidge's head. It doesn't work. It's chaotic in there. It's chaotic in Pidge's head. I don't like it. Good. Oh, good predict, bro. Good predict. Good predict. Good predict. I like that. I like that. I like that. Fair enough. Fair enough. I should. Uh, fair enough. It's a good thing I didn't go to Palafin though. Good predict. Good predict. Good predict. I like that. So he's he's flying now. 
He is flying now. He is flying now. We're going to pivot to you. <sighs> good predict. I like that. That was a good predict, Ridge. Great predict. Um, we safely get off the parting shot on anything. Unless he terror, unless he terror darts, terror, terror dart. Unless he does that, which fair play if he does. But that actually kind of serves us a little better. I thought. I do have to pivot, but and Grimstar will take a hit. But hey, Grimstar will live. Okay, we're getting a parting shot on something. We get to see what he sends out first, so. Mudzell. Okay. So we can pivot out to the Venus one. The question is, does he switch again? <sighs> Pidge. He's gonna switch. If I go to Venus he's gonna switch. If I go to Venus he's gonna switch. I mean, I have to go to Venus but he's gonna switch. He's gonna go back to Cinderace and we're gonna be right back in that cycle. But I can't risk it. I have to take this thing down. I can't risk it. Because I can go for an Earth Power. I have to get him. He's going to switch. He's going to go back to the Cinderace. Ugh, I hate getting in Pidge's head. It hurts. It hurts my head. <laughs> it's so chaotic in his brain. Okay, he lets it go. Fair enough. I think we go back to full health or close to it. Basically, yeah. So, Venusaur kills. He's gonna send out me too. Or does he go to Cinderace? Does he go to Cinderace? That's why he did acro. I just realized that's why he did acro because he was scared of the earth power. Okay. Okay. I gotta keep that in mind. That's why he didn't. That's why he did acro. It, it hit a lot of my team, but it also got rid of the earth power. Okay. He's gonna do it again, which is fine. I don't think it kills. Is that famous last words? Is that famous last words? Good sludge bomb. Yeah, it's good sludge bomb. Powerball. Mm. It hurts in Paige's head. It hurts, guys. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts. So. Hmm. Hold on. Let me think about that. Cause I could, I could pivot out to you. I have to introduce it at some point. I just can't let it take a hit. This is a tough one. I have to introduce you at some point. I don't want to let Grimstar go, but I have to. I have to introduce it at some point. I have to. Gunk shot. If he has gunk shot, fair enough. I mean, I could just hard spot to you, but I don't want to risk some fireball. If you have gunk shot, fair enough, Pidge. And if you predict it, fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, do we both switch? <laughs> Is the thing. Do we both switch? Because I will have the advantage if we both switch. Ooh, does he click a setup? He has Powerball and Acrobatics. Yeah. Okay, he's normal type. That's interesting. That's cool. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and click this. I swear to God, if you miss, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> if you miss, I'm gonna cry. Okay, we hit. Cool. He probably. Uh, he might not kill us. If we get a full peril, that'd be insane. Ah, uh, no, he probably will, actually. Yeah, I was gonna say. Cool. He's pure fire. Oh, no, he's normal, actually. He's normal right now. We're gonna go back to Palafin. He outspeeds us, so I'm not gonna Terra. Yo! You. 
Does he kill us? Cinderace is strong, man. I think we take a hit. Drain Punch hurts everything but the Mewtwo. Okay, cool. Palfin kills Cinderace. I, I hate giving up the Grimmsnarl the way I did. But hey, we had to do something there to make sure Palfin can get going. We had to do something. It's just annoying, man. Because I had I had plans for that comb fest, so him not bringing it. I, I figured he wouldn't bring it. I knew he wouldn't. I knew he wouldn't. But I still planned around it, obviously. I think I like nine kills in the last two matches. <laughs> Sly King. Giga Impact. He's going to hit me. Does he predict the switch? Does he predict the switch? The guy hasn't teared yet. Which isn't great. Chat <laughs> Encore. Um... Nah, I don't think he predicts a switch. We're just gonna drain punch. This thing is bulky. Get game pack. Oh wow, he went first. He went first. He has truant. Doesn't kill. I got I like the gambit. We get a lot of our health back. I like the gambit. He's just trying to hurt me enough. He has to recharge. Another drain punch kills. He's gonna let it go. Yeah, he's just trying to hurt us. He's trying to hurt me, man. <laughs> Sly King. Mewtwo and Snorlax. Does he go to Snorlax? No. No, he doesn't. Not yet. He goes to Mewtwo. Yeah. He's going to hurt us. Thunderbolt? At least we can see what he has. He can't click flamethrower. If he has flamethrower, he can't click it yet. He can't. You can't risk that. You. As much as I wanted him to tear first, he's tearing. Okay, he is tearing first. Water. Okay. Okay. That sucks, but okay. That is not good for us, but okay. <laughs> It was not good for us. Does he have Aura Sphere? I don't think he'll have Aura. I don't think he'll have a fight to him. He might have Earth Power. Thunderbolt. Wow, wait. That's, that's, that's something a lot. Oh, no. <laughs> um, I mean, I'm kind of down to just do this. I can't encore. I can't. This this is still hurting. That's the thing. Yeah. So me to use water, Terra. That's gonna resist. We still die. But well, good to know. So he has Thunderbolt, Terra Blast. Thunderbolt, Terra Blast. Oh no, it doesn't resist. I forgot. But I, I I always forget Steel's resistances. They've changed so much through every single gen. All right. Here we go. We kill this thing, but it's just about the damage it does to us. He did a very good job of saving his, uh, his Snorlax. Earth power, yep. We outspeed the Snorlax for sure. I don't know if we kill it though. It has Earthquake. It's gonna kill us. The question is, do we kill it? I think we Sunstill Strike. And just hit it with the strongest ability, the strongest move we got. And hope. That's all we can do. I think we... I think we kill. Snorax's defense is not that good. What else do we got? What else do we got? It comes down to that. Damn! It lived on red. It lived on red. It comes down to, I mean, art probably like 20 HP. Damn! That was a good one, though. That was a good one. I don't mind losing like that. That was a good one. That was a good one. 
Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Maybe I could have played Rash Ram a little better. Maybe I could have played uh, Whatchamacallit a little better. Grimmsnarl a little better. Blaziken, too. I definitely made a couple mistakes in there. I, I mean, I definitely made a couple mistakes. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I definitely made a couple mistakes in there, but... Man, Pidge got us. He got us. He got us. He got us. Got us to bring Zamazenta. It's a sign he's going to win. Uh, <laughs> but now it is what it is. We move to 2-2. Two and two. Pidge, 4-0 and oh on the season, which is crazy. Uh, next week, we're taking on Carlos and the Montebello Marpico, Mr. Toast, uh, which is going to be an interesting one. It's going to be a fun one. We got the yin and yang going off uh, against each other. Zach Rahman Rusher. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's going to be it for this one. If you guys enjoyed the video, and if you're here, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Check out all the coaches in the description. That includes Paige. I did not plug him at the beginning of the video. Check him out in the description down below, as well as all the other coaches. Go subscribe to all of them. They're all fantastic people. And uh, yeah, and of course, be sure to share socials with your friends, family, everyone, you know. Like people know how long here it's at. We'll see you guys in the next one.